What is good? What is happening? What is proper? It's your boy TRD TKE. We are at the Afro Geek Fest. I'm also with to Tom's Hall, Uncle Tom's Hall. We are out here and represent the one and only Geek Wave. It's on the FM 93.6 in the building. We're going to be talking to the people out here. We're going to be learning what is happening in the geek world. We are here. Arvatsai. What is happening, everybody? Geek Wave to an FM. We are out here at Afro Geek Fest. And we are here at Afro Geek Fest. We are here at Afro Geek Fest. As I'm speaking, I'm standing next to one of those people. Who are we talking to? Uh, my name is Umpile, uh, Umpile Dubodu, all the way from Northwest. Um, and yeah, we're, we're here to support the Afro Geek Festival. Yeah. Um, yeah, Tapelo is a guy we met at Comic Con, and uh, he let us know that he was doing this, and we just had to be here. I, I so, prob. Yeah, yeah. So tell me about this. What's, what's going on here? Um, so today, what we have um, is our flagship comic book title, uh, Young Nelson. Yeah. And now what we wanted to do was to take the values of Mr. Nelson Mandela and place them in a younger character who would face the, uh, the challenges that we see South Africa faces today. So it's a fictional character, his name is Mo Africa. Yeah. Um, and he gains the name Young Nelson when he volunteers at a local boxing gym. When people start seeing his boxing skill and, and his leadership, they start to liken him to a younger uh, Nelson Mandela. So he doesn't like that name, but the more he starts you know, doing heroes of, uh, acts of heroism, uh -huh. The more he starts taking it, he starts taking it as his uh, superhero alias, the same way like a Batman or a Superman, and uh, yeah, uh, Mzanzi's number one hero, Young Nelson. Yeah. All right, <laughs> so I have Young Nelson. This is the, it's a comic, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, this is Young Nelson. How do they find it? How, where do they find it? Um, so we are available on an app called House of Comics. Um, should they want to get themselves like a digital copy? And then um, with regards to a physical copy, we are available on uh, all good bookstores, so bargain books. Just ask who we're looking for Young Nelson, um, and they should be able to find it on their computer. Ah, perfect. So how do we follow you, guys? Oh, uh, at Rainbow Nation Comics, um, yeah. on uh, uh, Instagram, uh, YouTube, um, Facebook. Yeah, Twitter, we're, we're, we're not there yet. Yeah, yeah Twitter, we're not there yet. Yeah, but 100%, 100 yeah, yeah. they're still going to find you. Young Nelson is available, and then he told you where you're getting it. Shout out to this guy one time. Shout out to the publishing, shout out to what you're doing. You're doing amazing stuff. From the Geek Wave to an FM, Afro Geek Fest, we are here. Dumelang, Geek Capity from Geek Wave, and I am with... Sinazo from Spiso Etik. Please tell me what you're doing. Um, we go around schools training teachers on introducing robotics and coding. Amazing. Can you please tell me about this robot here? So this is Masana. We call her Masana. It's a robot from China. We purchased it from China, from Cruise. Is it cruise? Okay. Yes, it's cruise. We purchased it from Cruise. Our Masana, she can dance, she loves, she gives hugs, she can tell you she loves you and you feel lonely, you know? Really? <laughs> yeah. Do you want can to see her dance? Please. You can pick any dance from these ones. Um, uh, let's see. Okay. okay. So she's asking for you to keep a distance of one meter so that she can start dancing. Now she is dancing. So this is entertaining, especially for kids. Sometimes other kids, they do join. When, when she's dancing, they join. Follow, follow her, her, her routine or whatever it is. This is so nice. So besides dancing, what else can... Can this do? So it gives hugs, and I say, as I said, it, it loves. When you want a hug, please give me a hug. Okay, you can interact with her. You talk to her. Tell me a joke. She tells you a robotic joke. Even if I wanna ask, uh, let's say anything educational, anything, not anything. She's programmed to tell a weather, a joke, and her name. What's your name? She tells you. My name is Masana. Masana means uh, sun raising Tonga. Okay, that is so amazing. So how do people get you on social media pages? Um, we are at Sviso Etek. What is happening everybody? TRD TKE, Twan FM 93.6, representing Geek Wave. We are here at Afro Geek Fest. And I can skip my manure, but we can't get my manure. This guy can money, can't get my money. 
I didn't believe what I, this is actually something that is real, that is painted. I thought this guy just printed these things. Apparently he paints them. Who are we talking to? Uh, my name is Sihe and I'm from Pumalang. City? Yeah. Oh, this is you. You painted this with your hands? Yes. What? No way. Yeah. But it takes a lot of time, but yeah. I know it's unbelievable, but yeah. Wow. So, oh, oh. Yeah. On IG is CM2885 and TikTok is CM25. So when if anyone wants to order your stuff, just go on your social yeah, media and then yeah. you find it there. Yeah. Everything. Ah, big shout out to you, Sitle. This yeah. is amazing work. Thank you, man. Thank you. Away, away. So on FM Geek Wave, Sitle is doing amazing stuff. Check out his stuff online. He gave you the handles. Let's go. Kinakapidi from Geek Wave Sunny FM and I am with uh, you're with Makoto Mapoto from Zanzi's most e most wanted e-sports. <laughs> okay, okay. So how's your day? How's Afro Geek? I mean, it's amazing being at Comic Con and doing Rage before and doing such events. It's first of all, it's very refreshing to see um, black people tapping into the geek uh, market. We haven't been seeing a lot gaming as a career, and in Af Africa, I think in the statistics of the world, Africa is like the lowest in all continents when it comes to careers in gaming. But we're equally as capable. We are also equally as you know as equipped. But then it's it's because we are not. There's no education around the market, so this is very refreshing to see this going to a township. The fact that I'm not in Santon today, guys. <laughs> okay. Nothing against Santon, but the fact that it's in Soweto, too, you know, and we've got other um, entrepreneurs in the same market. Yeah. It's amazing. Okay, so can you please tell me about Murava Rava? Yo. I've been attracted to this. Yeah. I think oh, it's yeah. because of it's, it's a childhood game. Yes. So can you please tell me about this whole thing? Okay. So when we started, the first league that we hosted was Candy Crush, and we had I think a prize of 50k cash and 25k for number two, and then number three got a shopping voucher if I'm not mistaken. So how we tapped into Maraba Raba because we are an African company and we're very African based, and I'm sure yeah you guys could pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> from my first comment. Um, we are trying to also preserve our own games. Gaming has always been something that has brought uh, families together. You're yeah. saying in your childhood, we were playing this right? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> now what we did was build um, the same version with the same rules because in different parts of the world it's different rules. So we have a South African version online and we're trying to as much as possible preserve the culture and keep the, the the theme, the African indigenous game theme, you know, just because fourth IR is a thing now, we can go online and still play those games, you know. Really? Yeah, we, we can actually download Muraba Raba, created okay. by us. <laughs> this is nice. Yeah, um, so when you go to your app stores, the one you should download is written Hekima Council as the company that developed it. Um, that's us also. So, yeah. Media platforms at Mzansi underscore esports. And on YouTube, we are Mzansi's Most Wanted. Thank you so much. Guys, this is Morava Rava. Um, thank you so much for the interview. Please enjoy. Have fun. Do come back and play. Are you coming up back for the I'm going to play. I heard someone saying uh, tournament something. Yeah, so we have a tournament running from half two. And we are going to be giving away, for number one, we have 1,000 rands worthy of a voucher for from Take A Lot. And then number two is going to get 500. And then number three, of course, that's going to be the one that wins between the four players first, um, is going to get uh, some of our merch. Amazing. I'll, I'll pass by. You better. <laughs> what is happening, Geek Nation? TRDTKE from Twan FM 93.6 representing Geek Wave, Rekamohara Afro Geek Fest, the Moso Tomo. And I'm hanging out with the people. One of the people who's doing amazing stuff. I just want him to let us know who are we with. Yeah, um, I'm Emmanuel Mutsache and I'm an XR developer. Yeah. So, as you saw on the floor, I was showing you our Indogo stick fight. Yeah, so, this yeah. is an African based VR game where you do stick fighting. So, you know, there's a lot of games who are more or less European, yeah. but there's nothing that's like South African or African. So, yeah, yeah. yeah, so that's why we did something similar to that so that even like the youth can be inspired that you don't need to go outside to get inspiration. Yeah. There's inspiration yeah. here back home. And also, 
it's our responsibility to take South Africa to the world, not bring the world to South Africa. 100%. Yeah, 100%. So, so, so uh, you guys, this is like what you do on a regular basis. You work on VR, your company is about VR, everything else, the, everything that you do is about VR. Yeah, so everything is VR, but mostly we're doing like training simulations. Yeah. So VR for training, mines, oh, VR yeah. for like science experiments. So that's more on training. So the entertainment part is something that we do on the side. Okay, so uh, in your company, in your VR company, like where do people find you? How can they get access to what you guys do? So uh, the company is Immersive Hub, so you can check us out on www.immersivehub.co.za. So that's where you're going to see our gallery, where our past projects that we did, and also the current ones that we're busy with. Immersive? Immersive Hub. Immersive Hub. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's so I named it Immersive Hub because we don't only deal with like training, we also deal with like entertainment and ads as well. So AR basically. Yeah, yeah. 100%. Yeah. You heard it from the man himself. Immersive Hub. Go check them out. Immersivehub.com. Eh? That's the website. Don't see all those ZA. Immersivehub.co.za. Make sure that you check out. They are doing amazing stuff. I tested it out earlier on. Ah, dear Nadia Bo. Nagalala Tamano Mumbe and Nagamara Fiarela. Any more of life. TRT case on FM Geek Wave. We are here. Afro Geek Fest. What is happening, everybody? TRDTKE, Twan FM 93.6, Geek Waves Twan FM in the building. We are here, Afro Geek Fest, and I'm chilling with one of the people who's doing crazy, amazing stuff, as you can see in the background. Ah, I, don't, I don't think you can see, but we're going to show you the, the snapshots of what this guy's doing. Who are we talking to? How's it, guys? You're talking to Kurosai. So basically, we're a small little anime shop that's just building itself up. Basically, our main goal is to provide an anime-based culture to the whole of South Africa. We start off small, building up, getting a lot of traction, we have amazing stock, we have a lot of characters, we're actually branching out to have our own OC characters, Tenchi and Kasukana, so that's basically the story. Yeah. Anything you like anime related, you know who to hit up. So you just mentioned that you created your own anime characters, in what, in what form? Is it animated or like it's a character that you are selling in product? So, she is, so both the characters are actually animated. They are anime characters that we have had drawn by both local and international artists. Yeah. Basically we have Tenchi, she's our Kurosai's main character. Yeah. And then you have Kasukana who is Darren Superfly's OC. Kurosai do Darasi. That's it. Big shout out to you. You're doing amazing stuff. Shout out to you. Afro Geeks 1FM, we are out here. Geek Wave. Let's get it. <laughs> 